we got a lot to get through today. Quite a bit. Well, first, let's check in with the Magic Duff Bucket. And let's go from there. What do you got for me, Magic Duff Bucket? Oh, what is this? Is this called Skull? It's a porter. It's not a stout. Skull by Three Floyds. Gotta love Three Floyds. I mean, I don't know if it's required by law. But damn. I'm drinking a porter because I don't have any of these really tasty stouts and I don't really want to risk a plague to go out and get new stouts. So we make do as we do. First world problem. So I'd like to set the stage for this unboxing with a little bit of poetry. This selection comes from this tome, today's great poems by the famous Poet Society. <clears throat> the boy I was. If I had a time machine, I'd find the boy that I was. And every time he'd cry why at me, I'd quickly explain, just because. And for all the wounds he'd display, I'd softly assure him that time does heal. And for all the lies he believed, I'd quietly show him what was real. I'd find the boy that lived in fear, begging to be saved. I'd tell him that future's road is long and rarely is it paved. I'd find the boy I never wanted to be and show him it's all right, no matter how dark things might get. Keep reaching for the light. Well, friends, if that boy was here, he's about to get his time machine. give you a few minutes to collect yourselves. I don't normally like to start out with such heavy emotion, but I feel like this called for it. It's a special thing. We're all hunkering down, avoiding the coronavirus, and uh, drinking our second tier beers, uh, not the preferred beers, and opening first rate books, just making do as we do, you know, in the bunker. subterranean bunker but um you are all really here for the for the book and so am i it's a sun tough book it is a sun tough book the extras bookmark So this is The Time Machine, the first of what is now a four book, a four book set from H.G. Wells. This will be followed by uh, The Invisible Man, 
Now a major, now a major motion picture. Major. And uh, War of the Worlds. And then at some point, probably in 2021, we will all get um, um, Island of Dr. Moreau. Here it is, a very slim tome. I read this as a signed reading in college, and it is a great book. It is a really fantastic book. And this book comes with a lot of extras. Oh my gosh. Here we go. And um, it includes the original short story that inspired the novel. Um, it is signed, I believe, by H.G. Wells' great-grandson. It is printed letterpress. This is, I'm sorry about the lighting. I had to send the lighting crew home because we're social distancing right now. There is the artwork. So there's an introduction by Simon Wells, a note on the text, the time machine, the gray man, and the chronic Argonauts. Yeah, apologies for the really crappy lighting. Um, so this is the numbered edition. They only published this in two ed or three editions. I'm sorry, three editions. Numbered, lettered, and Roman numeral for the very first time. Dying to see how those look. Here is the signature page with the number 23. It's a beautiful, beautiful book. I'm really glad I jumped on this. Even through the gloves, you could feel the texture on the cover. Um, this nice little quarter binding. Really, really oh, fantastic book. So thrilled. This makes uh, uh, sheltering in place worthwhile when you have an experience like this to look forward to. Um, it is it is all so much fun. I will show pictures and such um, so you can envy it, uh, it at a safe distance. Um, yeah, I cannot wait. Oh, look at this. You have to line up, line up the clocks or you could have two different times and then you could have a time travel experience. Yeah, my jokes are on back order. Um, they didn't make it in time for the unboxing. So, really, really thrilled to get this. Oh, I love it. I love it. And um, right now, there are four books you can buy on Suntup's site. Four books. Let's, let's go through them together. Four books. I, um, wait, Red Dragon, A-G-E. Brother numbered edition. I am legend um, uh, numbered edition, people. There are six copies of those. That's my next Suntup unboxing. And then um, Fahrenheit 451 AGE. I, I don't know why those exist, but you got to get over there and get them and scoop them up, especially these artist gift editions. They're very affordable um, and gorgeous, just flat out gorgeous. Gorgeous gorgeous. Um, the next unboxing I'm going to do is an SST book, uh, Cabin at the End of the World by Paul Tremblay. I, I pronounce his name like a douchebag. That's what I do. That's my value add. Um, stay healthy and safe out there, people. Really, seriously. Um, no joke, you know. I mean, it is an introvert's paradise, a book lover introvert's paradise, but apart from the threat of death. Um, so anyway, um, stay healthy, my friends, and uh, I will see you at some point in the future um, it, as we travel through time together. We're all traveling through time. We're all going into the future in increments of like nanoseconds, all of us. We are all time travelers. Read that book.